I greet you all in the matchless and marvelous name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Today I am going to talk about don't judge anybody. One day a doctor was rushing to a hospital by getting an emergency call. As soon as he was reaching the hospital, his OA father standing in front of the surgical ward or waiting for the doctor. When the doctor came near to him, the father started to question him, telling that what kind of arrogant doctor is he? Don't you know how to manage the timing? Is it the time that you have to come? We have called you before, but now you are reaching. But the smile doctor gave reply. Sorry, I was actually out of station. I got this emergency call so that I was rushing to come here. But the father was not ready to listen what the doctor was telling to him. He continued, Are you a doctor? You think if it is your son waiting for an emergency operation, will you be late like this? You just think if your son is going to die in an ICU and you will be late like this? The father out of angry, he started to questioning the doctor. Again, doctor has given him a reply with a smile. Dear brother, everything up to God. Doctors can do their part, but living or dying, it is up to God. So, please be quiet for a minute and sit and pray, let me do my job. By saying this, doctor went inside the surgical room. After some hours, doctor came out with a smile telling that surgery was successful and he was rushing out without hearing any words from the father who was waiting outside. And he said, if you have any doubt, you can clear with the nurse who is there. And he just moved on. Again, the father got angry and started to questioning the nurse. What kind of doctor is this? He doesn't have a minute to give me a reply. Now, the nurse bowed down her head. And with the tears, she gave a reply to him. Actually, yesterday the doctor's son has passed away. And now he was in a funeral service of his own son. Because of this emergency call for helping you and your son, he left everything and came for the surgery of your son. And now it is successful. Now he has to go back and cry for continuing the burial service of his son. By hearing this, the father shocked. He has broken and he thought, how arrogant I am without knowing the situation of a person. My dear friends, in the same way, sometimes we may judge a person by looking the appearance. Sometimes we may judge a person by listening something from others about the person. Sometimes we may judge a person by the little knowledge about the person. But before judging a person, make sure you know the person well. There is a story. One day, a father was going in a train with his young son. On the way, the son was looking outside of the train and shouting, Look, Daddy, the trees are going behind. The sky is going behind. By looking at this, all the people were wondering. This 20 years or 19 years old boy telling that trees are running back. The people were laughing. From that, a man was asking to the father, why don't you take your son to a mental doctor? He has some problem. But this time, the father with a smile gave a reply. Actually, my son doesn't have any mental disability. 
he has been a blind up to today from birth he was blind and today after his surgery of eye we are going back to hope so that he is wandering to see the world as it is first time he could not realize that the trees are not moving so today my dear friends i would like to tell you that don't judge anybody don't judge until and unless you have the exact proof before judging a person make sure you know the person well